So today we're gonna talk a little Liverpool football. Now in my room, on my window, I have a little red card. And on the red card it says, Hicks and Gillette out now. Well, maybe they don't, they don't have to be forced out because Tom Hicks just sold his Texas Rangers baseball club for around 300 million pounds. George Gillette sold his Montreal Canadiens hockey club for I believe 185 million pounds. And Hicks still owns the Dallas Stars, so he could sell the Dallas Stars and get funds from there. Now, it's been well reported that Liverpool is in immense amounts of debt, and they owe about 250 million pounds to the Royal Bank of Scotland. This crippling debt has not allowed Liverpool and Rafa Benitez to go after the players that they desperately need to sign to make the club better, to turn it around, and make Liverpool a great football club once again. With the combined sales of the Canadians and the Rangers, Gillette and Hicks have almost 500 million pounds in pure profit that they can reinvest back into the club. They only have a 250 million pound debt yeah, only, but that's 250 or 200 million pounds that they can spend on Liverpool to sign the players they need. So I honestly don't know why the we're talking about Liverpool's cash trapped and, any, and everything. No, well, the owners have the money, it's just that they're choosing not to spend it on Liverpool right now, which is just insane. Anyway, we can always uh, look at other teams and see a glimmer of ray of hope. Manchester United has over 700 million pounds of debt. West Ham has over 100 million pounds of debt. And with Portsmouth, it's been well chronicled their financial troubles. They didn't even pay their players until Christmas recently. But the difference between Manchester United's debt and the reason why nobody's bitching about it and the reason why Liverpool fans are complaining about is that Manchester United is winning titles, winning trophies, winning games. Liverpool is not. Manchester United has a great team and a, and a worse debt. Liverpool right now, we're not a very good team and we have a terrible debt. I really, really want the American owners, Gillette and Hicks, to reinvest that money, put it back into the club where it belongs. Let's go after sign some players. Let's go after sign some attackers. As Torres suggested, great suggestions by him. David Villa, David Silva. Those would be great signings. Absolutely incredible signings. I would love those signings. Anyway, it doesn't look like we're going to sign anybody in January since the transfers window is almost closed. But in the summer, since Liverpool has that money that they can invest in their team now, or at least the owners do, we're not going to have to sell Gerrard and Torres and Mascherano like those idiot papers are selling. No, we're going to be able to go after and sign players, or at least I hope we'll be able to. So that's all for today from Joe at JLB Sports TV. Follow me on Twitter at JBlock49. Um, keep, it, keep this thing going. Play Ryan Babble, save Ryan Babble. Let's keep it going, people. I like the response from the last video. We got the support of the Ryan Babble fan page. Empire the Cop on Twitter um, runs a great website. He featured my video. Got lots of support for that. And just about every single day, we just have somebody new tweeting, play Ryan Babble, play Ryan Babble, creating that trending topic. Ryan Babble even tweeted me back, thanking me for, uh, for starting this movement and giving him the support that he needs. So um, thanks to Ryan for tweeting me back. Thanks to Empire of the Cop for featuring my video, and thanks to everybody who supported me on the last video. Let's keep it going, guys. Hashmark play Ryan Babble on Twitter now. Give him the red card. Yeah. So every single day I sit at this window for maybe a half hour hour trying to get people to notice the red card trying to get the American owners out you know get some Liverpool funds get some funds back in the club Gillette and Hicks out now yeah you know yeah there's an ambulance down there see yeah they know it they're getting the message yeah they are maybe this, this car this car Gillette and Hicks out now you know it must be a Man U fan.